Blue. I'm a man. Look at this ratty, nasty. Look at that. Look at that fly mask. Just disgusting, torn up. Time to be pitched out. NRS does a catalog two times a year and I just got my package in the mail and I'm excited to open it because it's got a lot of great goodies in it. different jeans and these have always just been my favorite these are the Wrangler George Strait edition the cowboy cut these are actually I think these are the ones I'm wearing right now you never have too many jeans honey yes yeah, so we know or I know Boom. I, I do your laundry <laughs> double fly mask obviously the boys both needed new fly masks number one for comfort and fit you can get cool colors this is a cool color. No, Gray. And then I picked up a new rope. This is the uh, Republic Rope Ranger. This is actually a ranch rope. I believe it's a, yeah, it's their ranch rope. This is the Republic Rope Ranger. Uh, it's a four strand, three eighths, um, and an extra soft. So I'm actually excited to use this. I felt like I needed a ranch rope in my life because usually if I ever do any ranch work it's just with like an old head rope and so I wanted to just try this one out and I hadn't used this one so we're gonna give this bad boy a go. I can put it in my rope bag that I forgot the other day. We should probably just put that in the trailer. We should probably just put that in the trailer. We've made the... you braiding his hair? Made the executive decision to not ride him today, but just go ahead and lunge him. You know, he's been off, let's see, Sunday we roped, Monday he had off, and then today, yeah, I was going to ride him, but honestly, he doesn't really need it. He just needs some more exercise and just to kind of stay legged up and loose. So I think that's what we're going to do today. Instead of going ahead and just saddling him all the way, we're just going to let him run around the round pen for a little bit and uh, get some excess energy off, and then we'll ride him on Wednesday and then we're gonna go practice on Thursday so it'll be like a good solid week worth of training. When I put these horses in the round pen the first thing that I do is just let them walk around and just kind of do whatever they want to do. I don't immediately get on to them and start working them. Um, I just let them kind of go at their own pace and, and be leisurely and then we'll get to it. Surprised he hadn't wanted to roll though. Come on, get to work. It's perfect. Yeah. I like these because they have the ears. Yeah. They look like alien horses. Mm -hmm. Now yesterday on my Instagram I put up a question sticker asking everybody what is their favorite bit for their horses and we had some really cool answers so I wanted to show off uh, my favorite bit that I use on blue all the time. Um, if you're new here, if you're new to horses, maybe this will help you out a bit. Okay, so this is my favorite bit. This is the one that I ride on blue all the time. It's got this really kind of long shank. Um, it's nothing fancy, nothing, you know, nothing crazy, but it works the best for him. It has a square port, right? Kind of a, a higher square port. 
and then on each end instead of having a bar it just has this one link right here and the thing about bits is that everybody kind of has an array of bits like i've got a bunch of different bits here and this is not even very many but i have a bunch of different styles and the thing about bits is just finding the bit that works best for your horse and uh all of these bits i will ride blue in but as far as like day-to-day -day wear team roping wear this is the favorite it's got a just nice simple chain curve on the back end and uh, yeah honestly I don't remember who even makes it I think somebody told me one time but I totally forgot it is an older one I think I've had this for I think I've had this for what five years so. yeah maybe five years or so and then a buddy had it you know a few years before that so it is definitely worn in but it's it's my absolute favorite it's not a real harsh bit but you can really get a hold of him with ease you know you don't have to use a lot of pressure and for him to really kind of break at the pole and be soft and supple so this is the one that blue loves and uh yeah this is a great one thank you guys so much for watching in the comment section below let me know what style of bit that you like i know there's a bunch of people that really love the carrie kelly bits and uh that is definitely on my list a bunch of those carrie kelly bits are on my list to buy so let me know in the comment section below thank you guys so much for watching make sure to subscribe we'll see you next time